Welcome to Cozy How To, your place for a snuggly, warm learning experience. This is lesson number two for the Equus Shopping Cart software. And in this lesson, I'm going to talk about adding new products and continuing where we left off in the previous tutorial. And the key areas that we're going to focus on is how to add a category, how to add a description, and how to upload an image for your product. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing that you want to do is make sure that you're logged into your administration panel for the Equus software. And if you're logged in, you want to go to the product for Molly's Chocolate Chip Cookies. And if you don't see this page by default, you want to click on the Catalogs tab and then click on Products. And it should take you to the page that shows all the products that you have available. And you want to look for Molly's Chocolate Chip Cookies. And when you find that, go ahead and left click on it and it's going to take you back to the products page. OK, but before we get started, there's one thing I want to mention about the SKU that I didn't mention in the previous tutorial, and that's this. Those pound symbols that you saw in the previous tutorial, you could have deleted all of those and replaced it with your own personal SKU. So if your manufacturer gave you a SKU, you can delete that whole thing and use the recommended SKU, okay? So that's what I wanted to mention. The next thing that you wanna do is take a look at the category section. And under that, you'll see a button that says add categories. And if you left click on it, you have two sections, fruit and vegetables, but neither one of those categories are relevant to cookies. So what you want to do is click on the text that says manage categories. And if you left click on that, it's going to take you to the categories page. And you'll know that because in the upper left hand corner of our screen, in big bold letters, it says categories. Now, by default, you should see some text that says new root category. If you don't see that, make sure that you have the store button here selected in your navigation here on the left hand side and then click the button above it that says new root category and then your text should say new root category there so once it says new root category there by default you should be under the general tab and if you are let's go ahead and move forward first let's go ahead and give this category a name by clicking in the name box and we'll call it variety of cookies and to the right of that you'll see availability and what this basically means is if it's enabled they'll be able to see this category on your website. So if you want them to be able to see the category for variety of cookies, make sure you have that enabled. The next thing we're going to do is change the category image. And you'll see that there's a picture of a camera here. And to the right of that, it says upload and change category image. And beneath it, we have an option to choose a file from our computer. So let's go ahead and left click on that. And I'm going to pick this image to show on the website and click open and it's going to upload and replace that image. OK, now you can see that it shows the image that we just uploaded. And the next thing we're going to do is scroll down some and we're going to give this category a description. So write whatever description you want to give for this particular category. I'm going to say an amazing variety of cookies made by professional chefs. OK, so write in whatever you would like. This is just an example for one sentence. You could write multiple sentences if you want to. It's totally up to you. So once you have all that done, let's scroll to the top of our page. And in the far right hand corner, you'll see a blue kind of rectangle with the word save. And you can either hit Control S or you can left click on the checkbox and it's going to save our changes. OK, so once you save those changes, we're going to go ahead and click on the products text for our for under the catalog section. So click on products and it's going to take you back to Molly's chocolate chip cookies. And you'll now notice under the category section, we have an option for variety of cookies. So let's go ahead and left click the checkbox and select that and hit OK. And now it's added to that particular category. We're going to go ahead and scroll down and look at the description section. And we're going to give Molly's chocolate chip cookies a description. So I'm going to write uh, the most amazing cookies ever created by Molly's chocolate chip company. Now you can write in obviously a more relevant description. You can say maybe the chocolate chips are very moist and delicious. I don't know, whatever your product description is, you would write that information in. And I apologize if you can hear some noise in the background. 
unfortunately some environmental noise I can't totally remove from the audio and is out of my control so hopefully you don't hear too much background noise uh, the next thing we want to do is you know go to the bottom of our page and give this image a change so that we can have an image on our page for uh, the product so we're gonna go ahead and change the image for this particular product so click choose file and then pick an image off your computer hit open okay you'll see that it now shows the image replaced and if we scroll back to the top of our page we're going to go ahead and click on the option that says save and if you left click on that it's going to save our changes so now that we've made all our changes the next thing that we want to do is go to the upper right hand corner of our screen and click on the blue button that says visit storefront and this is going to show us what that category looks like on our website and you'll see that it says variety of cookies and it shows an image of that cookie so that's our category and if we left click on it it shows us the image of the product here which is Molly's chocolate chip cookies one pound bag and if we left click on that it takes us to that specific product page okay and beneath it you'll see that it says the most amazing cookies ever created by Molly's chocolate chip company the chocolate chips are very moist and delicious okay so now you know how to add a picture a category and you know how to upload images for both your product and for the category itself. I hope that this video was helpful and if it was, don't forget to embed, comment, share, and subscribe and stay tuned for future tutorials. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment. And if there's any improvements that you'd like to see, please let me know. And thanks again for watching Cozy How-To Tutorials, your place for a snugly warm learning experience.